Hey guys, it is lunch break. Oh my God, it's been freaking busy today. It has been like crazy, which makes the day go faster, which means that I get home that much faster. But uh, gotta tell you guys something. I need a new camera. Every time this one here gets dropped, and I know you guys are like, don't drop the camera, but I'm talking about just a soft drop. Um, I have to reset it because it goes out of focus. And then also it's taking longer and longer for it to actually turn on to where I can start recording. So that's not very good. I'm taking a quick, quick trip to the Dollar Tree simply because I need to pick up some spray bottles. And if you guys have ever sprayed paint through spray bottles, you'll know why I have to pick up several of them. <clears throat> Excuse me, but lunch was good. <laughs> See, if you're listening to this in Greece, then that would have been like a high compliment to the chef. I will show you guys what I got in a little bit. I gotta get my butt back to work because I'm running a little late. I'll show you everything here in a little bit. I gotta get back to work. Ah, keep work. Stupid work. Stupid seat belts. Actually, cool seat belts. And the rain starts now. Exactly the time that I'm getting off of work. It's still dry outside. And it just started to sprinkle. I was supposed to have already done this. And okay, anyway. Headed home. Um, Maddie is doing some blood work in the haunt. So that's really exciting. So this is Phoenix's school. <laughs> he has this cool app on the cell phone. Apple. <laughs> no, that's a banana. Banana. So I just didn't want it to be a Lori Lee-less or a uh, Phoenix-less vlog, right? Right? If we could go out there and help you, we would. <laughs> I know. All right, I'm gonna get changed so I'm not in my precision tune garb all freaking day. And then we're gonna go in the back and see what Maddie's up to. We also got some fan mail. Woo! So if you guys want the address, that's it right there. It's Lakewood, by the way, where the sticker's at. Okay, freaking. Whoa. Hey, you opened the last thing. Yeah, but it's always for you anyway. I never get nothing. Well, except for the nylons, which is awesome. If it's a sex toy, I get it. Wait, I mean, wow. <laughs> I didn't mean that. Wow. wow. Okay, so there's a long letter. I will read this. And there's a card. And there's more stuff. Uh. Ooh. Ears Fingers. and a finger. Two, fing two ears and a finger. Excellent. Coolness. Nice. We're, we're doing stuff the opposite here. I should read the we letter. We need more first. body parts. It says, it's Halloween. Good luck on another year of awesome haunting. Keep up the good work and happy haunting. Colton W. Who Aww. needs a hug? Aww. <laughs> Hugs all around. <laughs> yeah, but did you see who's offering the hug? <laughs> I'll take that hug. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, okay, hold on. Let me read this note real quick. Aw, Colton, that was very nice. Thank you. Um, I'll, I'll have Lori Lee uh, write it, but um, in, in a nutshell, guys, he basically just said that, you know, uh, what I've said before about, you know, you guys know me, but I don't know you guys as well as you know me. Uh, he gave a little bit of information about himself, and also he added to uh, the, the ears and the finger, he added uh, Alan Hopps um, liquid latex uh, for the most part, and uh, Alan's uh, faux blood recipe. So thank you very much, Colton. That was really, really cool. Very much appreciated, and it's people like you and all of you guys out there that, you know, keep me going, honestly, because, yeah, there are a lot of days, like you mentioned, there are a lot of days that's just like, okay, you know, and especially she feels it and he feels it too because I'm in there editing every night, but, you know, it, it's... Well, no, the only reason I feel it is because I feel stuck in here while you're out there having fun. Oh. Oh, well, good news. Um, Annie, stop by from work, and I might have a babysitter to watch Phoenix while you can come out and help a little bit. So, um, that's good. So I would like to decorate my solarium in my basement, and I really would like to put some touches on the freezer room. Yep, yep. i like that to be... Me, 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 me. Coolness. Hi! You're bloody! 
That's awesome. Hey, just in case you guys were looking at Facebook, she was the one that I sent the note to that the little picture up there or whatever about like taking out of context. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, this is cool. You know, is this I, I what you were looking for. No, this before? no, this this is cool. Um, I, I was just looking at it. and It's like, you know something? This is really Ronald McDonald right now. <laughs> yeah, not your fault. I'm saying I can't wait till we do the mold work on this because it'll, it'll, I think it'll bring it in a lot better. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> what are you playing? Is it haunt music? Uh, it's just opening. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> cool. No, I like it. It looks like stuff happened. And of course at night, it's light. Oh, man. Yeah, I sent you a picture of her doing it too. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Did you get it? Is oh, that is that the picture you sent me of her? Wow. Yeah, she's like crouching. <laughs> no. I got a little carried away. I got on the... <laughs> you know, it's it's funny because that right there, it, it's, I, I, I call them haunt stains. I know that you don't watch the vlogs or anything, but just before we started doing all this work, I was like going around picking up things in the house, like the back screen door to the our actual house, it has red paint on it from when they did blood work like two years ago or something. It's like, ooh, haunt stain. So yeah, it's, it's okay to get a little crazy. You guys remember when I said that you have to stretch the plastic tight in order for your roof to not like sag and have a puddle of water up there? <laughs> that roof is so tight that it's lifting up the, uh, the panel right here. So I have to, uh, yesterday I went and I put this in to try and stop that from happening. I put this brace in to give some counterbalance that way to push. Um, but yeah, it's still doing it, so I'm gonna add some weight to it. The what? Ready for the solo? Solo what? Oh man, I didn't play it. <laughs> Just kidding. Here's the, the solo. Let me flip. Never mind. Just kidding. It was gonna be awesome, and then it, the internet decided not to work. Bam, <laughs> bam, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure if this helps, but it makes me feel better. It's pretty heavy. It's so funny, every once in a while I hear this huge <laughs> against the wall. <laughs> and then overspray. <laughs> so what I'm doing right now, guys, is I'm taking, where are they? Uh, the eaves pieces, and I'm finally putting them up here because I'm gonna take a five foot wide piece of plastic and attach it over this part right here, all the way from the front to the end of the haunt, the two sides, and then I'll take care of the center stuff there. Uh, trying to do this before uh, before it gets too much darker, but I have to cut my pieces because this is the first year we've ever had a wall here and a wall here. Usually we just come off right here and the peak can overhang a little bit, so I need to uh, accommodate changes. Keeping with standard fashion or whatever of introducing all of you guys to all the new people that we get. This is Alyssa and this is Abby. So these are our newest additions to Hellmouth. So thank you guys. Very much appreciated. And they've actually been through the haunt. Wait, did you go also? So both of you have went last year and then two years ago. Did both of you also go? I don't think so. Yes. Okay. I know I've been here at least twice. Okay, cool. I can't remember, I can't remember what years. But anyway, they gave it high praise, and I'm like, yes. In fact, Abby just said, what did you say about the, the cost and everything? Oh, well, the, it ranks right with all the other ones, and you don't cost $40 to get in the door. <laughs> cool. That's awesome. I love to hear. I love to hear that. I don't love to hear that. Are you okay? Are you going to survive? You look extremely lame right now. Not impressed. Yeah. <laughs> all right. But thank you, guys. Thank you. Haunt update. I finally got that last piece of plastic cut. Got a little bit of blood on it too, that's kind of cool. Uh, but it's not up there, up there yet. Um, I'll do that tomorrow. If you guys know anything about plastic, if you've ever used a contractor's plastic and tried to put it up in the dark by yourself, it's really difficult. So I'm just gonna leave it until tomorrow. And a little note on the blood work. Um, you guys are gonna say, oh my gosh, it's like almost neon red. Well, keep in mind that number one, the light's going to be down, so it's actually going to appear more bloody, or actually, you know, it's going to appear bloody, even with the lights down, because it's not going to be dark, and it's not going to look black. You don't want black blood. Uh, but number two, it is going to darken as it dries, so that's one thing to be aware of also. But look at this. 
Look at freaking blood all over. All over bloody walls. Bloody walls. Freaking badass. I love it. All right. So, and there's blood back there too. Now you can't really see it from here, can you? Oh, wait, wait. Oh, oh, hold on. I got this. I got this. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, I still have to show you guys what we got. I keep forgetting, sorry. So yeah, let's do, sorry, bright light. Uh, let's do that. <laughs> you guys are like, oh, bad daddy, and then he started laughing and everything. He's like, oh, as long as I'm way over here, it's funny. Anyway, guys, I just want to show you what uh, the stuff that I got today at the dollar store. Each night, two actors are going to get chosen above, above and beyond the, the fan favorite. So these are little gift boxes that I got. And see, there's nothing in them yet. So there's uh, four there. And then these two special little gift boxes right here for the last night. Look at this one. This one's kind of cool. Look at that. That's really neat. There's that and that. And then some pencils. So there will be two pencils in each one. And then I saw these. These I actually kind of got for the haunt. I want to see what they do. Motion sensing rats. And then over here I got all this stuff too. So just little trinket stuff. And we'll put more stuff in it. But just, no, just this like a little thank you. Ladies and ghouls, it is time to reveal who are the four top fans um, as determined by YouTube. Don't get mad at me. It's all YouTube. And there's been a lot of people lately that have been sitting there and like just liking every freaking video. So it's anybody's game. It may be somebody that, you know, has, has been a long time viewer. It may some, be somebody that's brand new. So we just don't know. I don't even know yet. I haven't even looked. So here's what we got. We've got the four cards. We got this one, and this one, and this one, and no you don't get your choice, sorry, <laughs> because I'd probably end up screwing it up anyway, and that one. On the inside was the little Ghostbuster sticker that we got from the Krispy Kreme, and then a couple of the, the haunt stamps that people have given me over the years, which is really cool, and a business card, which is even really cool too, so there you go. And I'll write a little something in it too, before I send it. I would do a drum roll, but everybody's sleeping and they probably get really pissed off at me. So I'm not going to do a drum roll. I need to sort by, and it's got default engagement subscribers, subscribers since like the oldest and the newest. So I go by engagement because that's what we just got through doing. I click that, and the top four are Tyler Dominic, Crystal Sherman, Jeremy Chenoweth, and, and, uh, oh wait, uh, who's the last one? Gurgoylia. So I'm not going to show anybody else because I don't want anybody sitting there thinking, oh my gosh, you know, I could have been it, I should have been it, because that just kind of sucks. Um, so congratulations to you guys. Um, all of you guys, subscribers, all of you guys are winners and you all mean a lot to me, but you know, like I say, I'm not a rich man and I just want to give a little back and this is kind of fun too. So there we go. Tyler, Crystal, Jeremy, and Gurgoylia. Gurgoylia. Try saying that wants to send me your address through your channel name on YouTube in a YouTube message and uh, I will get these out to you as soon as possible. Cock quickly! Matthew Rondell, thank you very much for putting in the work um, and yeah I think that uh, Jason Christopher is right I think that there's like an eight hour time difference between Pacific Standard Time in the US and England time. Well actually this is one of my favorite screwed up comments of the night. King's Men Somebody watches CTFXC, dog text, and that's why. I thought only prepubescent girls watched that guy. I was going to formulate like a math equation, like uh, basically like CTFXC plus you equals you watched it because you know, so therefore you watch CTFXC also, therefore you are, according to your own definition, a prepubescent girl. Prepubescent girl but I didn't do that. Lori Lee commented and said it all. 
Rhode Island Haunter, do you guys give out candy after they go through the haunt? If so, what kind do you recommend? I used to give out candy. Um, I don't anymore because there's so many people and we had to do like a, a patrol in the neighborhood to pick up all the candy wrappers because a lot of people figure that the world is their trash can and there would just be trash all over. Um, so we stopped doing that and it got really expensive. I used to give candy glow sticks in like bags with our address on it so that people knew where the candy came from. I used to do that for the first like 75 people um, and I didn't give out crap candy. I gave out candy bars. I, I hate hard candy for Halloween. I don't know why. I like the I like candy bars, something that you can like, and candy corn, and sugar daddies, and and licorice. Yeah. Ooh, and malted milk balls. Those are pretty cool too. Uh, just none of the hard candy. I don't like suckers. God, how many lollipops did we get when we went trick or treating? And they were the last thing to go. At least for me, it was the last thing to get eaten. And <laughs> that Barb girl watching that glob of whatever was in the can of black paint while eating lunch. Not a good idea. <laughs> That's funny. Jordan Winton, happy freaking birthday, dude. Kyle Dotson, um, have you ever heard of this uh, haunted boat ride on a real river? Does this sound safe to you? And eh, not really. I mean, it, anything has an inherent risk when 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 you go on water. So yeah, I don't know. I'm not. Sure. I don't know how you would do that. Halloween Haunter, call the actors characters. <laughs> nice. I like that. All right, guys. Happy hunting. See you tomorrow. Oh no, I got killed him. Oopsies. How did that happen? <coughs> oh no, he's alive. Everybody run away. And now I'll find a gun and I'll shoot you. <coughs>